Hi and hello. Anne has herself another Stitch Fix box. Yes, I paid the $20 styling fee and the shipping is free and the box has arrived on the doorstep. Oh, this is exciting. Will it be a five for five or will it be a one for five or will it be zero? This is the first top. It is size medium. All the tops today will be size medium. This is Kylie Tina short ruffled sleeve knit top and it is $35. And one of the things that attracted my attention was this sleeve ruffle. I thought that was absolutely adorable. I don't have much of this color in my wardrobe, so I thought that would be another reason to consider this top. And if I back up enough, you can see the length. It has a little scoop there and enough coverage down the back that I can wear it with leggings and still cover up some of the tushy. So I am pleased with this one. The back is simple and plain. And yeah, I think we might have a winner here. This is Bobo, B-O-B-E-A-U. I guess that's Bobo. Zaya Surplus Side Tie Knit tank and it is $48 and it's a little bit low cut but it is stitched so that if I <clears throat> lean forwards I'm not going to be <clears throat> bringing the girls out. Um, I like this pattern and the material is soft. I was afraid it was going to be itchy from the underside. I was afraid that was going to be itchy. It's not. And it comes down and it hits, if I hitch up my britches a little more, it hits just below, there's the button on the jeans. So it hits just below that. And there's the tie. I've got it tied in a sloppy bow. You can tie it in a knot. What I did notice is if it should come untied and undone, it is stitched all the way through the bottom. So if the tie comes undone, the whole thing doesn't come open and I'm not flapping in the breeze, if you know what I mean. This is from Market and Spruce. It is the Taley Crisscross Back Knit top it is $35. It is a nice soft knit. A little clingy but not overly so. I like the neckline. I like the length. It's just straight across. I tend to wear most of my tops untucked although it could be quite readily tucked in. And as the, the description said, it is a crisscross back. And that is what you get for your crisscross back. I thought that was kind of neat. Something different. I really don't have that in my wardrobe. So this is another one to consider. And like I said, it. It's clingy, but it's not overly clingy, and it's soft. And it is something basic enough that I could wear this year round in colder weather, put a long sleeve top underneath it. There is enough room within the sleeves and the armpit area to tolerate having another top under there and not feel like I'm all squinched up. Here we have the Mason and Bell Lalani Embroidered Knit Top. This was something else that I'd kind of had my eye on. It is $39. And I like the embroidery. 
at the top of each corner. It's only on the front. The back of this one is plain. It's all the same material. It's a nice, lightweight material. I will say, when this puppy arrived, oh, she needed the iron. And I did check the care instructions. It says that you can use a warm iron, but iron from the underside. And this top needed an iron because it looked like she'd been crumpled and rumpled. So I did the best I could with an iron, and she looks much better now. I like the way the sleeves come. So I could, as we work our way from winter into spring, I could get another top underneath here. Maybe something in a white or an off-white neckline is nice back up a little bit it comes to a nice length there is a fancy uh, knitwork I guess you would call it across the bottom just in the front not in the back it's loose enough but it's not too loose and I don't know how well that showed up for the knitwork, so let's see if I can scoot this up a little bit. That is what it looks like. And I've had my eye on this one for a while, because one of the things you can do on the Stitch Fix app is to mark or pick your preferences. This was one of my preferences, so I had asked specifically to have this one show up in this box. So I'm glad to see it here. I think this one will be a keeper. This top is from Michael Kors. It is the Saria V-neck mixed material blouse and it was $68. I've had my eye on it for a while. It's gone on sale for $33.97. I like the color. The neckline is good. It's a little on the scratchy side, but nothing that I can't stand. It's two different colors of fuchsia. So the front is one color and the sleeves and the back are another color. And for care instructions, because I was concerned that this might be dry clean only, it does say you can use dry clean as an option, or you can wash this inside out and put it in a lingerie bag. So that is probably what I will do. This one also needed a little touch with a warm iron when it got here, but nothing horrendous like that other top. That other top, oy, it definitely needed help. The other thing that I like about this is the length, and it has a little slit on the side, but not too much. The length does come down, so if I wanted to wear it with leggings, I could and keep my tushy covered. It also has um, a flounce, I guess. I don't know if this is really a flounce, but it has a double layer. But the one is cut a little bit shorter. I thought that gave it something else a little bit interesting, a little bit special. And to get a Michael Kors top, would I normally pay $68? No, I don't think so. But for $33 and change, yeah, I think I might. I'm attracted to shiny colors or bright colors. <laughs> I'm as bad as the camel. So leave us a comment down below. You've seen the five tops. What would you pick? Would you pick all five? Is this a five for five?
What do you think? And if you are liking what you see, I have a link in my description box down below that will save you $25. So you get your first fix basically for free. And I also will gain a little bit out of that should you decide to use it. And let's go back and meet up with the camel and talk about the nitty gritty and see what I decided to get. That was a fun try on. Yes, I was pleased overall. Do they make boxes for camels? I don't think they do. You're not good at sewing, are you? No, I'm not. Anyone out there good at sewing? Getting down to the nitty gritty over here as to, is this a five for five, a one for five, a zero for five? Well, taking a look at the card again, my stylist was Tara. She's been my stylist all along. And I was semi-pleased when she sent me the email that you get after you pay your styling fee. The stylist will pick some items. You get an email with pictures of the items and you can say yay or nay as to if you want them to send those items. I picked two of them and the others I said no thank you because, well, to put it bluntly, the patterns were ugly. Oh, that's not good. I did not want to go around looking like I was wearing a pattern from the 1970s that should have been on a sofa, couch, Davenport, city, whatever you want to call it. I didn't like those patterns. Might be great for someone else, I, you know, each to their own. They were not what I was interested in. So I had picked several items that were saved on the app. So she was able to go through that and send me things that were more to my liking. That's a nice feature that they have. It increases the chance of it being a five for five box. Yes, it does. So looking at the nitty gritty of all things, we have the box as a total and that does say that the Michael Kors top is on sale, so I'm getting the sale price. The stylist's picks subtotal is $100.97. If I buy all five, I get a discount of $47.74. That's a 25% discount, and that's for all boxes. If you buy all five, you get 25% off. So that gives me an order subtotal of $143.23. So that would average out to be $28 and change for each item. Not a bad price on the average. Because I paid a styling fee of $20, that gets credited to whatever I purchase. But if you don't purchase anything, you forfeit the $20. Correct. So it kind of behooves you to try to find something to apply your $20 towards. Shipping is free, both to you and if you decide your stuff to return, the return shipping is free. They send you a prepaid envelope and the envelope is big enough to hold everything that they send you. So if you wanted to return everything, the envelope is big enough. So my order total, if I buy everything, is $123.23 and then they have an itty bitty little print at the bottom. Note, additional sales tax may apply. 
Can't get away from taxes. No, you can't. But $123, since I've already paid $20 into it, $123 for five tops, that's not a bad price. No, that is not. So, I'm getting all five. I am excited. It was time to refresh the wardrobe in the tops department a little bit more. I really didn't need shorts or jeans or leggings or sweaters or anything like that right now. I needed to continue to refresh the tops that I have. So I picked all five. It was a five for five for box number eight. Yay! So thank you for watching today. Comment down below. What do you think? Please give this video a thumbs up like and consider subscribing to our channel. That is free. Yes, it is. <laughs> Not much in life is free these days. We thank you for watching. Check out the description box below if you want to try Stitch Fix because there is a link down there that will get you your first box without a styling fee. And I will also get a little something um, towards my next box. Thanks again for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Don't forget to watch something puffing up on the screen. It could be interesting. <laughs>